This is James Prescott Jewell, an English physicist born in Salford in 1818. Jewell studied heat, not like that though. He was responsible for discovering the relationship between heat and mechanical force. Jewell was the privileged son of a wealthy brewer and was tutored by famous scientists when growing up. He was fascinated by electricity and often experimented with his brother by giving electric shocks to each other and to the family servants. Jill grew up to become manager of the brewery. Sometime around 1840, he started to look into replacing the old steam engines with the newly invented electric motor. Motivated by trying to cut down on his costs, Jill realized that it was cheaper to burn coal in a steam engine than burn zinc in an electric battery. Further research was made into which fuels and in what amounts produce more energy when being burned. He experimented on the amount of mechanical work generated by friction needed to raise the temperature of a pound of water by 1 degree Fahrenheit. Joule named this as the mechanical equivalent of heat, in which he specified a numerical value for the amount of mechanical work required to produce a single unit of heat. The initial announcement of his results at a meeting of the British Association for the Advancement of Science in August 1843 was met by complete silence. However, in the years to follow, many famous scientists including Lord Kelvin, Hermann Helmholtz, and Michael Faraday worked with him on different inventions and theories. His efforts had a profound influence on the theory of conservation of energy, which led to the first law of thermodynamics. In honor of this great scientist, the standard international derived unit for measuring energy is called the joule. Its symbol is a simple J, and one joule is approximately the energy required to lift a small apple through a meter of air.